Hello everyone, let's start with question number 8, exercise 1.3. It says you use Euclid's divisional logarithm to find HCF of 441, 567 and 693. So in this case, we need to take any two numbers first. So I would be taking 567 and 693. So my A is the bigger one, that is 693. B is 567. So, we need to use formula A equals B Q plus R, that is Euclid's division logarithm. So, A in this case is 693, B is 567, so 693 divided by 567. Quotient will be 1 only because 567 into 1 will give us 567 and 693 take away 567 is 126. Now Quotient is 1, remainder is 126. Now we need to convert B into A, R into B. So it will be 567 here and 126 as B. So 126 into 4, 567 and 126 into 4 will give us 504 and 567 take away 504 is 63. So 126 into 4 plus remainder is 63. Now 126 is my A and my B is 63. So 63 into 2 is 126 and the remainder is 0 here. Now the HCF of these two numbers is 63. Now what we need to do further is we need to take this number. And we need to take the leftover one that is 441. So now we need to find Euclid's division logarithm between 63 and 441. So A is 441 and B is 63. So 441 equals 63 into 7. 63 into 7 is 441 only. So the remainder will be 0. Now 63 is the HCF of these three numbers. Whatever the HCF we get from after two after these two steps, then that will be your HCF for all the three numbers. So your answer is 63.